Hello, my friends, and welcome to my channel. Today, I'll be teaching you how to design a check flyer. Take your devices and let's get started. In the description box, you will find a link to this abstract background. Now, type city at night into pixel window and pick another background. Resize to page, then convert image to curve. Then with the node tool, cut the excesses on the sides to tidy up the page. Go to Effect Studio and tap on Gaussian Blur, set radius to about 108 pixels, and tap Preserve Alpha to avoid banding at the edges. Then go to Blend Mode, and you may want to sample all but apply Subtract. Now type Fashion Men into Pixel Window to select a nice photo with a clean looking gentleman as our pastor. Looking for a nice photo of a cool gentleman. I think this is good. So let's select that. So resize into position. And for the reason of saving time, I will delete this and paste an already cut out image into the document. Bring it into position. And for the same reasons of saving time, I will paste the text I already copied to clipboard. Now pick the main title, Night of Fire, and make the night of the boldest. Also change the font to a font called Citrica. Centralize it and choose color gray. Pick the gradient tool to apply gradient grayscale to the text. Now duplicate the text and with the top layer selected, readjust the gradient and to add a stroke outline, pick the pen tool and set width to 0.1 to add a tiny white outline. Now select the lower layer, tap on stroke, make it gray, and set stroke to five points. That is good. Yes, that is good. Now let's work on the fire. Select the fire, make it equally big and change to a stylized font that is called Scriptina. Set in place and bring in fire background from Pixel. Bring in fire background from Pixel and make it a chart layer to the fire layer. Yes. Clip the background as a chart layer to the fire layer. Set the background in place. Set it in place. And clip it into fire as a chart layer. That is good. That is good. So now to create the effect of a tongue of fire coiling around the upper text, the night off, then duplicate the fire layer and drag one below the night off layer. Zoom in to the affected area 
and why the top fire layer is selected, tap the eraser brush tool and set width to a size that is a little bigger than the width of area to be erased. Then carefully clean off the affected area. Now with the rectangle tool, let's draw a rectangle for the date and time of event. Remove the fill and reduce the outline. Then convert it to curve and select the node tool and break the lower right corner point. Then move the node point to the left to open the box. Bring in the text and arrange them the way I am going to do. And note that the main font, apart from the stylized font, is Cetrica font. So all the fonts here in the box are all Cetrica fonts. Now draw another rectangular box, remove the outline and apply a gradient of red and send the rectangle to the back of 10 p.m. and make 10 p.m. black. And Friday, September, the day and the month, make that one red. That, that is good. That is good. The 10 p.m. black on the gradients. That is good. Then bring in 2022. That is already spaced out. So bring it in. Type the live streaming and in the text studio, tap text positioning and set tracking to about 700%. Now let's work on the church name and address. So highlight the church name, the city gates, and increase the size. So to increase or decrease the font size with gestures, you tap and hold the text icon, then slide up to increase and slide down to decrease the size of the font. Now type fire, increase the size and change font to Antonio Bold. Remove the fill and make the outline red with about two points. Increase it again and bring it to back and set together with the background. Now apply overlay blend mode. And it looks like the outline is tiny, so let's increase it to about four points. Now duplicate the fire twice and drag them down into position and fill the middle one, the middle layer of the duplicate with red. Remove the outline. Fill with red and remove the outline. To position it accurately, you may need to go to Transform Studio and use the Y to move it, the X and Y, to move it up and down, left to right. Draw another rectangle from outside the page and convert it to curve. And with the same node tool selected, tap the lower right corner node and delete it. 
apply gushing blur of about 220 pixel then move it to the background below the fire layers Now tap this fire layer and look for the fire background of the child layer and increase it, reset it so it looks better. Looking at the entire design, you can see that the arrangement of the letters, the text, is too close to the bottom of page. So select the title and other text around it to move them up. To do this effectively, go to Transform Studio and move it up and down and put it in a better position. Let's highlight and move it up. Yeah, that should be good. Now let's bring in some light flare. And I have in my asset studio some life layers from paper farms. Let's pick one, reduce the size, resize it, and apply screen in the blend mode. So reduce opacity to about 55%. And this looks good. So let's bring it down behind the night of night of fire. Let's bring behind that. This looks good. And with this done, we come to the end of the tutorial. Thank you for watching and God bless you.